We get that decision tomorrow morning, Glenda. More on that in a minute. The Republicans this afternoon filed this in Lansing. They say a recount is a waste of time and money. There's no evidence of fraud or wrongdoing. This was a this would be a tremendous waste to taxpayers of Michigan. Green Party presidential candidate Jill Stein requested the recounts in Michigan, Wisconsin, and Pennsylvania. She raised millions of dollars in crowdfunding donations, and she paid $973,000 to Michigan yesterday, $125 per precinct statewide. Michigan cast 4.8 million ballots in the presidential election. If the recount is done by hand, Michigan Secretary of State says the cost will be close to $5 million. The objection from Trump and the Republicans, Dr. Jill Stein is not aggrieved by any mistake in the vote because she only got 1%. A recount cannot be completed by December the 19th when the Electoral College will meet and finalize the presidential election, especially if it's done by hand. Hand. And the petition for recount was not properly signed by Dr. Stein because it was notarized in Massachusetts. Republicans say they're not afraid of a recount changing the results. Donald Trump beat Hillary Clinton by only 10,704 votes. Donald Trump won Michigan. If the ballots are recounted, he will still have won Michigan. I think they're just trying to stir it up, try to gin up opposition to a process. And then finally, I would say, look, democracy is priceless. Our right to vote is priceless. We have to make sure that the system is working. The system hasn't been checked since the 1950s. State Board of Canvassers will meet first thing in the morning, 930, up in Lansing to decide this. And get this, there are two Republicans and two Democrats on that board. High drama as they meet first thing in the morning. Live in the newsroom, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. Should be interesting how it shakes down. Thank you so much, Jim.